Hi guys, in this video we are going to learn about rotation of an array. So in this video we are going to learn about exactly the left rotation. So what is exactly left rotation? Left rotation is the rotation in counterclockwise. So it would be counterclockwise. So counterclockwise rotation is known as the left rotation of an array. So for example, we are given an input array as let the input be an array which is given as 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. On left rotation by 1, we would be getting the output as the first element would be moved to the last and the rest of the element would be shifted one position before. So the output would be given as this would entirely be the same thing and the first element would be moving to the last so our output would be 2 3 4 5 1 so this is how we have to perform left rotation of an array where the first element moves to the last and the rest of the elements are shifted by one place okay so for example in uh, so now we have to solve it using uh, a particular uh, using a particular algorithm so what should our algorithm be so we must save the first element into our particular variable and we can shift the rest of the uh, values to the left so for example if I have a temp where I am storing the first element that is suppose add of 0 and then I am shifting my rest of the elements to the left hand side so temp is equal to 1 now I am shifting my left rest of the elements to the left hand side so now my array would be looking as 2 3 4 5 and 5 so this would be my array and in the next part I would be just replacing this particular value with my temp so the result that we would be getting would be the left shifted array that is 2 3 4 5 and 1 so this is how we can perform the left rotate of an array by 1 so let's just go to our pie charm and let's start, uh, code this particular solution so def left rotate by 1 and we need to take in the input as the list r and the length of the list as n so we would be left rotating by 1 of array arr okay so now we would be saving the first element into a variable as temp now we would be starting from the first index uh, from the second index for i in range uh, let's start from the first index and let's go till n minus 1 okay n minus 1 since the last index must not be uh, the last index cannot be replaced with a uh, c if i am going till n minus if i am going till n that is the uh, last value would be n minus 1 I need to replace it with some uh, next value but since there are no next value present so we would be just going till uh, the range parameter would be n minus 1 that is we would be going till n minus 2 that is in this case it is 3 uh, sorry in this case it is 4 so we would be going 1, 0 1 2 3 sorry so it would be 3 so we would be going till the third index so this is how we would be performing our uh, operation so we would be going till n minus 1 uh, that is uh, n minus 2 the range parameter would be n minus 1 that is we would be going till n minus 2 and we would be placing the value of r And we will be placing the value of r of i is equal to r of 
i plus 1 that is the current value of my this index would be equal to the next value and I would be placing r of n minus 1 is equal to temp okay and now we can just return r so this is my array and let's declare our array as we had taken 1 2 3 4 5 and let's just print its uh, print print its left rotate by 1 so left rotate by 1 let's just pass the array as well as the length of the array that is length of r and let's run our code here so as you can see that we have successfully left shifted our particular uh, left rotated our array by 1 so we are getting 2 3 4 5 first and our first element in the last that is 1 so this is how you have to perform left rotate by one uh, thanks for watching this video guys see you in the next one